Was finding a job hard in the 70s for you? No. Finding jobs were pretty easy because I did easy jobs. I did things like um, restaurants uh -huh. and restaurant jobs were easy. And I worked in a dry goods store for a while selling clothing, you know. Uh -huh. And uh, no, I could walk out and get a job pretty easily. I worked for a telephone answering service. They were easy jobs, so they were easy to get. What was the longest job that you worked for in the 70s? In the 70s? Was I in the state in the 70s? Hmm. Uh, telephone answering service I worked for. Oh, okay. For quite a while. I worked for that in uh, in Texas, and when we moved to uh, Phoenix, they had sort of a sister place. Oh, okay. And I went and I worked for them for a while. Okay. And I liked to the telephone answering service. It was interesting because you got to talk to different people. Yeah. <laughs> all the time, you know, and uh, they'd call and ask ask for their phone. Mm -hmm. For whatever phone uh, call them, you know, you yeah. tell them, you give them their um, phones, and sometimes they they say um, their name. And one Italian guy called, and he said his name, and I spelled it back to him. I said, "Is that how it is?" Yes, he says. How did you know that? I said, because I come from Brooklyn, <laughs> and I'm used to Italian names. <laughs> he was so surprised that I could spell his Italian name. That's cool. But uh, you get used to them in, in Brooklyn, the Italian, yeah. the Polish names, uh, you know, all the different ethnic names. You get yeah. used to them, Jewish names. Oh, that's cool. So you pick them up in Brooklyn. <laughs> that's cool.